I have me pueblo, me familia, and they are strong in ways I am not. In ways you have yet to witness. What do you get when you give an artist paper and time? If you're anything like me, you're probably not thinking a whole last entire short film. The scene you just saw is from Bonita and the Bandit, a show in the short film Gruff. And it's not even the focus of this video. What? Hello and welcome to Under the African Sun. I'm your friendly African NPC and welcome to the channel. Like, comment and subscribe. At this point, you're probably wondering, that is, if you haven't seen the film, what the hell is Gruff? Well, Gruff is a 2024 short film by Julian Curie. Or righteous robot about well in my opinion love this short film is just oozing a love you just can't ignore from the story to the making of said story you can just feel it from every single scene shot the story has more than you would expect a nine minute short film to have compared to the spider within which I've covered on the channel, check it out. Gruff is a bit more broad where Spider Within was more laser focused. Action, it got it. Emotional investment, didn't you hear me say it's about love? A cute character, I give you bow. Lesson or should I say a message? Definitely. And maybe I'm biased, but this paper puppeteering wizardry has me so impressed I gotta give him a point for visual appeal. If I had to compare it to anything, I guess it would be like a pizza with all your favorite toppings. Stuffed crust, straight out of the oven. The whole shebang. Sorry, I gotta make a call. Yeah, hi. Can I get a large Hawaiian with extra olive and extra pineapple? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay, thanks. Right, where were we? Gruff is one beautiful piece of art, and Julian managed to convey his message so well, it brings me to tears. If you read the description of the short film, you'll get the gist of what I'm talking about. And honestly, how it was made is quite impressive. I respect the art of filmmaking. So many moving parts come together to form a singular vision to tell a story. It takes time and more effort than I would do justice briefly mentioning it here. Even the trash that gets spat out on a weekly basis takes more effort than most would like to admit. Time and effort were not spared in the making of this project. Three years of designing, building and puppeteering this film shows and it is fucking amazing. You know something like this would never be allowed by Hollywood. We have less artists and more boardroom corporate by the numbers people making decisions for the projects that get greenlit. To some extent, maybe they are right. But I have 6.6 .6 million reasons at the time of making this video that say otherwise. What? I guess the most important part of this short has to be the dialogue. And by that, I mean the movement of the characters' mouths when they talk. You don't get a behind-the-scenes look into how these things get done. So... Huh. Would you look at that? A few moments later. Three techniques. That's the total number of techniques this man created to solve the problem of dialogue. And it is seamless. I can only imagine how things like lighting could have been tricky. He built everything by hand and I have to ask, how much paper was used in this production? I need a number I can wrap my head around. How is that information even useful to you? What? I'm curious. You'll give up in a week. I didn't say anything, jeez. 
I hate you. All jokes aside, everyone involved in the making of this project poured their hearts and souls into this, and I say thank you for sharing this with the world. This has been one of my personal favorite videos I have ever come across on YouTube, and a beautiful piece of art I got to experience. Nice job, team. I gotta admit, it really hit me right in the feels. I especially wasn't ready for this. 49 seconds. That's how long a certain sequence in the film is, and it captures everything I love about this short film. 49 seconds of two people just finally connecting without a single word said. And they just get it. Fuck, why can't the world be like this? I know most of us don't mean the things we say. And most of the time you want to take them back. But you know nothing beats that feeling when you look at someone and you just know. Love is a beautiful thing and living in the year of our Lord 2024, we tend to forget how beautiful it can be just to love. Love your friend, love your wife, love your brother, your daughter, your uncle, your dog, your cat, your mom and dad. And most importantly, love yourself. I can feel the love this project was made with. And love is bursting out of every single scene in this 9 minute short. It's so in your face, you might just miss it. Hazel didn't miss Abuelo's love. And when the time finally came to say goodbye, she only learned how much more her father loved her. I hope you enjoyed this video and leave a like to show some love. Hey, that's the theme of this whole thing, isn't it? Subscribe for more content, much appreciated. And check out any of these videos on screen. I've been your friendly African NPC. This is Under the African Sun. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace. Ding dong. Ooh, is that my pizza? <laughs>